All right, welcome to today's video. Today is March 8th, and me and Hayden decided to get out and try to do some herping before we're going to get like four more days of snow. Um, we've had some pretty good weather lately. It's been in the 60s at midday and stuff, and we just got out of school. So we decided we would come try to check this Plains Garter spot, and I was able to find a small one. I'll show that here in a second. I just got to flip the camera around. But yeah, it's a, it's a nice day. We thought we'd take advantage of the warm weather before it gets cold again for a while. Um, so, super glad. Caught a plain garter snake. I'll show it here in a second. But these are our first snakes of the year. Alright, so here's a look at him. This guy is super small. Uh, I mean, there's my finger right next to him. Super small, super skinny. Hasn't shed yet, so he's not the best looking. Um, but you can tell he's hoping to find a meal soon although he'll probably go back into hiding for another week or so because the weather is supposed to get super cold well not super cold but it's going to snow for four days and be in the 30s and so there won't be stuff out for a bit but glad we could find something beginning in march found some plains garters hayden has another one but he's grabbing his camera right now so we'll show that one in here in a second but it ended up working out glad we checked the spot all reliable and we got some early spring snakes. But a cool looking guy. Hopefully it wasn't blurry right there, but always fun to fun to find these snakes, even if they're pretty common here. Fun to find them when it's this early in the year. Alright, so this is the uh, lake we're checking out. Um, and this is the one Hayden flipped. So this is the our second snake of the year. And this one is a lot bigger and looks a lot nicer too. Like it kind of looks like it might have already shed, which would be pretty surprising but he's a good looking guy we didn't want to flip too much but we flipped just enough where we could find a few things and then we'll save the rest for when it's a better time of the year but we wanted to find a couple snakes before it got too cold for a few weeks as i said before but just a just a good looking snake that orange stripe always just super cool hayden got a camera so he's gonna hopefully get some good shots this year with that before that, that we've just been using our phones but man such cool animals we're gonna get some pictures then we'll release them and see if we can go somewhere to find something else all right we're gonna let this guy go this is the bigger of the two it was also better looking, but it was the second one we found. Um, it was just under this rock. I'll set it down in here. Ah. And it will find its way. There it goes. Awesome, there's the second snake of the year, and now we'll release the first snake of the year. All right, and here's the first snake we found, the smaller one, and Hayden just can release under its rock. Alright, I think now we're just gonna probably go flip some salamanders and then we'll call it a day. Alright, so we have a salamander right here um, that we flipped in this electrical box. And we found these guys here before and we just wanted to come check in on them. They were out and about. Um, there might be more in there, but I didn't move too much stuff around. But I'm just gonna set them back down there where he was. And we just checked another spot where we've seen two other ones before. Um, but it it looks like they were dead. We they it they didn't seem like they were doing well, as in uh, they were dead. But here we just flipped that electrical box, and there is eight, eight, eight of them all right here. And these are all these are all small guys, but they seem to be doing well. We were a little bit worried last year because they were so small and all in there. We wondered if they'd make it but they made it through the winter unfortunately the other ones we saw did not um and the other ones were bigger and healthier too but i guess it's just just didn't work out but these guys are all doing well well enough that we'll just release them back into their box here in a second but this is this is super cool and they're all super small though and still skinny but i mean they've, they've made it like a full year now so it's working out i guess they're probably just younger they're all starting to move around now. We'd move them into the sun, but that's a lot of work, and we want to release them here soon. So, um, 
you guys want to watch those guys for a second and I'll well we'll actually we got one more right here that we're gonna take pictures of because this one's the biggest with decent colors um, he's the biggest but he's still still not too big as far as tiger salamanders go um, but we'll let them all go momentarily after we get a few pictures all right so we're gonna release all these guys now I got two right here um, we made sure to put them all in the right box, but we don't know exactly in the box where each of them were. But there's plenty of little muddy spots where they can cozy down into. There's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Set them all back in their home where they'll hopefully continue to live here for a while longer. But yeah, it's an absolute jackpot. It was sad to see the other ones dead, but... It's cool that these ones in this area are still doing well. And uh, there's eight of them. And we got one left here to release. And uh, this guy was in his own box. So we'll, we'll just leave him there. But yeah, pretty cool. All right, so I realized I never filmed an intro and I thought I'd just do that right now. Um, that was like a week or two ago um, that we Caught the two snakes and the salamanders, um, but you can see we got a ton of snow right now, so I'm squinting because it's so bright outside. Um, but we got like two feet of snow a few days ago. Um, got out of school for two days, so that was nice. Um, but now me and Hayden are kind of just waiting for the snow to go away and for the temps to warm up, and then we should be in business. So we're we're excited. All this moisture is good for sure. Um, Hayden will be in South Texas uh, for spring break for spring break in a few days here and I'll be in southern southern Utah but once we're back from there um, we should be pretty much good to go for herping here in Colorado so we're looking forward to that um, but glad we could get two early snakes and a few salamanders but thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video